I am going to explain a problem which is based on coordination chemistry. Explain why cobalt NH3 whole 6 3 plus is an inner orbital complex whereas nickel NH3 whole 6 2 plus is an outer orbital complex. In cobalt NH3 whole 6 3 plus cobalt is plus 3 oxidation state it is 4 is 0 3 D 6. Nickel NH3 whole 6 2 plus nickel in plus 2 oxidation state it is 4 is 0 3 D 8. Now we can explain the hybridization model using valence bond theory. In the ground state it is 4 is 0 3 D 6. Now in the excited state there is a possibility that electrons can jump to the previous orbital and it get paired. So now here we can see using the red arrow I have shown that this electron jump to the previous orbital and get paired. Similarly these two electrons also can jump and they can pair. So now here we can see in the excited state two 3D orbitals are empty. Now these two 3D orbitals 5s and 5p orbitals they hybridized and form a new orbital which is called d2 sp3 now d2 sp3 orbitals are empty orbital of cobalt plus 3 ammonia is a ligand each ammonia can donate two electrons so six ammonia ligands can donate 12 electrons now 12 electrons are donated to d2 sp3 orbital of cobalt plus 3 and it forms these coordination compounds this type of coordination or this type of bond pattern or hybridization is called inner orbital complex. Now I am going to explain the hybridization model of nickel NH3 whole 6 2 plus using valence bond theory. In the ground state nickel plus 2 is 4 is 0 and 3 D 8. Here 3 paired electrons and 2 unpaired electrons. If one unpaired electron jump to get the paired electron there will be only one empty 3D orbital. So this is not going to help to make the D2 sp3 orbital. So that's why here they are using the 5D orbital which is already empty. So now in the hybridization state that 5s, 5p and the two 5D orbitals they overlap and form sp3 d2 empty orbital which the nickel plus 2 metal use for making the coordination bond with the ligand ammonia as i have already explained total six ammonia ligands donate 12 electrons they make coordination bonds with nickel plus 2 this type of bonding pattern or hybridization pattern is called outer orbital complex because here they are using the d orbital which is in the higher quantum number and this is the main difference between the inner orbital complex and outer orbital complex.